Hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to remove the background of this image. So I'm going to cut out the gun and remove the background. So a lot of thumbnails are made this way in the gaming community. So a lot of gamer, my gamer friends, hopefully you guys will appreciate this one. So let's get into the tutorial. All right. So the first thing that you want to do is when you have your image loaded into the program. So this program is called GIMP. It's very similar to Photoshop, but it's absolutely free. And I'll leave a link, a download link down below in the description if you care to download it. So the first thing that you want to do when your image is loaded into the layer section here is to right click on it and hit add alpha channel. And the second thing you want to do is go to the path selection tool here. If you don't see it in this uh, section here, you can go to tools and paths. So you want to select that there and that's the same thing. So now what you want to do is use the path tool to cut out your image. Now, if you need to zoom in like I am doing here, just hold the control button and use the wheel on the mouse to zoom in and out. So once you have the, the path, tool selected like I do here. All you need to do is start clicking along the path that you want to cut out. So there's one and then if you add another one, so click again, it'll start creating a path. So you can click, keep clicking along, cut out your path. You'll probably do it quite slow as you learn. Um, but when you get to longer stretches like this, you can actually move it back and forth and it makes it a lot faster. So I'm going to fast forward this video here. I think you guys get the idea. So just click along the path to cut it out and I'll show you what it looks like at the end. All right, so as soon as you get to the end, you're gonna wanna connect the path. So when you have your last dot here off the screen, what you're gonna wanna do is hit the control button for the last one, hit control, hold control, and then click on the last dot, or the first dot, connecting the last dot and the first dot together. There we go, now that completes the path. Now you're, what you're going to want to do is right click, so make sure you're on it here. Right click, go to select from path, get back on the path, select again, right click, hit select, invert, because you don't want to actually cut out the gun, you want to cut out everything behind it. So now that the image is inverted, you're going to hit either control X, which is cut or edit cut so control x or edit cut and that will cut out the background image so we'll do that right now control x and there you have it so if you want to get really particular with it uh, let's get rid of the path so we'll go back up here we'll just go to the move tool removes the path and you can also do select none to remove the the, the path so if you want to get really specific with it uh, you can all, obviously you can get really close there with the path tool or you can use the free select tool. So if you want to remove this background, you know, the sky that you can see through the gun, you can do it with the free select tool. You can either hold and click. I don't have a really steady hand, <laughs> so it doesn't work that well. Uh, or you can just do it like you did with the path tool and just click and select. And this one, you don't have to hold control. You can just click on the, the first dot there and then hit delete or cut again and it will remove it. You don't have to invert it because that's the part you want to remove. So you can go along, you can get as specific as you want with this. And 
there you have it. So that's how to remove a background on your image and keep the parts that you want. So hopefully this video helped you out. If you have any questions, please leave a comment down below. And again, if this video helps you, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much and have a great day.